Hello, it's your girl Yumika Jackable coming to you again with another YouTube video. In this video, I will be showing you how I boil a turkey. Well, the reason why I'm boiling this turkey, I won't even lie, is because I forgot to bake it. Now, I boiled my turkey legs already, and I had a lot of stock left. So what I did was I let it cool all the way down, and I went on ahead and put my stock in there. I mean, put my turkey into the stock water. Once I got it in there, of course, I had uh, already added the onions, and bell peppers, and celery, and I added uh, some oranges and added some apples to it, you know, to give this turkey a little bit different flavor from the turkey wings and turkey legs that I had already bought for Thanksgiving as well. Now, again, I said, once you put this in the pot, you know, you make sure you get a pot big enough before you even Attempt to boil this turkey, please, by all means, make sure you have a pot big enough to be able to submerge this in completely. So I already had made sure this turkey is laying all the way down, completely submerged in here. The only thing I can tell you for sure, as you can see, big turkey too. He will continue to try to float his little tail up on this water. So what I had... And to keep him from floating, to keep him making sure he get cooked evenly, all the way done and all the way through. I even put the turkey neck in there as well, but to make sure he gets done all the way done, I got this pot. I mean this top. You take the, a big heavy top. This is a cast iron top. Now I've already had it on here for a while. I'm just gonna put it back on here, like this, all the way in. I want this bird to go all the way down. So, as you can see now, oops, it's crooked. It's gonna be crooked no matter what, really. But as long as the bird is under the water, which it is, what you wanna do next is get you some one of these little plastic bags, which I've already used it on here already, but I'm gonna put it back on here because this turkey ain't nowhere near ready. It's one of those bags that you use to put in the oven. I wouldn't put a regular plastic bag on here at all. I wouldn't suggest that at all because I would be afraid that it would try to catch a fire. So I just flip my hands in a little. Flip my hands in a little. Come back with this here little flat pan I have because I want to keep all this moisture in here. This was just a pan I took off another one of my other pans. On there and push it up to make sure don't nobody come over here and bump my pot. And yep, one more thing. Big old cast iron skillet. Got that cast iron skillet. And I set it on top of there. Ain't nothing. You don't even see no steam, no smoke, nothing. And that's how I want it. So I'm gonna be coming to come in here periodically checking it. And I will do a second video on how this turkey come out. So if anybody would like the easy way to do their turkey for Thanksgiving and don't want to wait all day and have the kitchen all hot, just boil it. 